Welcome back. Today we'll be talking about vitamin B3. We'll mention everything from the function, the synthesis process, all the way to deficiency. Vitamin B3 is called niacin and it's found mainly in seafood. Niacin is important for redox reactions as well as NADH generation. It's also very important to know that niacin lowers blood VLDL and increases blood HDL. To synthesize B3 or niacin, you require tryptophan, B6, and B2. Niacin deficiency can be acquired by using isoniazide or carotenoid syndrome or heart knob disease. Remember that B3 have three symptoms when it's deficient, so diarrhea, dementia, and dermatitis. Here's a small quiz for you guys. So how do we treat flushing which is associated with niacin use? And what do we mean by broad color rash? And here are the answers. Alright guys, that's everything I've got. Hopefully I made this easier for you. Thanks a ton for watching and I'll see you guys later.